Well, hello and welcome to Camilla and I, another equipment review. Here I review equipment that I've actually purchased myself and uh, have got no ties or sponsorship to any particular manufacturer. And today we're interested in the quite expensive field of binoculars, at least if you get a good pair that is. So the pair we're reviewing today is not this pair because I don't always have it with me. I always forget this pair and leave it behind. Oh, just thinking I've forgotten mine again. Don't know how I do it. I've got no excuses now for leaving my pair of binoculars behind um, because these weigh about ooh, ooh, a couple of pounds, something like that. But the replacement for these is the CL 10x25 pocket binocular, which fold down to that small. It's incredible. When you put them side by side, there's an amazing size and weight difference. Yes, this pair here on the left way one pound 14 ounces or 840 grams. Oh, big boys. And this pair weigh 354 grams or 12 and a half ounces. So I know which pair I'd prefer to carry around. But I hear you ask, is this just a toy? gimmick pair of binoculars and the answer is from my use so far no these are a full beautiful pair of binoculars i mean they cost as much as a full pair of binoculars and boy they perform as well as a big pair of binoculars 20 optical elements nitrogen filled of course waterproof 10 times magnification, a 25 millimeter objective lens, a 98% field of view with 88% light transmission. Absolutely incredible in such a small package. With this pair, I've opted for the wild and nature package, which comes in this nice box with this lovely picture of a bird of prey in the distance mirroring the Swarovski symbol and um, you get a superb case nice padded case that you can either attach to the belt or it also comes with a strap to uh, for the case and then you've got the um, protection for the lenses you get a strap for the little bag and you get a strap for the actual binoculars themselves. So, uh, yep, all included in the Wild Nature Pack in this lovely Swarovski green colour. Ooh, beautiful. So if I was just bird watching, I suppose I'd stick with this uh, pair of uh, superb optics here. Obviously they are slightly superior to um, the optics of the smaller pair but I am actually selling this pair because unbelievably these are so good um, it is incredible um, the quality of these um, made in Austria superb optics I mean you really it is a big pair of binoculars in a small package you really have to experience them to believe them. So uh, get on down to your local optical store, in my case, Castle Cameras Salisbury, and just try them out. They also do, there's a, um, a CL500 version, which is um, 500 grams, slightly bulkier. I went for these sheer compact sizeness, but you can go for a slightly larger pair as well. So if I was just bird watching, I would, uh, yeah, definitely go for the larger pair. But as we have so much gear to carry around, and I'm always forgetting these little things, 
it also becomes quite burdensome when you carry around a pair of binoculars this size all day long. These literally dangle around your neck and you almost forget they're there. It's absolutely incredible. And as usual, it's the pair you have to hand that you use, not the pair that's in the car or at home. So these are that good. I'm actually selling this pair now and uh, replacing them with this CL25, 10 by 25. Absolutely incredible pair of binoculars. I mean, they're not the cheapest out there. They're going to cost you as much as a medium quality pair of full size Japanese binoculars. But these are unbelievably good. So to operate this pair of binoculars, it's absolutely easy as pie. Just fold out the uh, prisms, tease out, twist out, tease out the eye cups. You have a focus ring in the middle and you have a diopter ring, obviously preset at the front to adjust for use without glasses. Well, thanks for watching a equipment review on Kamala and I. And um, don't forget the usual like, subscribe and share for future reviews of equipment that we use in our wildlife dog thing. Have a good one. Bye from Camilla and I.